Today I'm going to make a short video about the Suzuki VS1400 starting issues. Now this will probably go across the board for other bikes because of the nature of what I'm doing. So let's give it a start. So it was really cold last night. Bike wouldn't start. And I've had this issue a couple of times even when it's not cold. Only I wasn't sure if it was just a cheesy battery or if the start solenoid was going bad, blah, blah, blah. So to start with, I thought, well, maybe it's just cold. We'll throw it on trickle charger and get a little more amps in there. And got it to charge, but it still wouldn't draw any energy to start the bike. So what did I do? I waited till this morning and started taking everything apart. Went through all the wires, made sure the stator was hooked up, made sure the start wires were all good, no corrosion. And went all the way up here to the starter solenoid and looked at it everything's cool so the next step what did i do well i took and crossed the two connections on the starter solenoid one's under that rubber the other one you can see i did it for a split second so that it melt anything or blow a fuse and it sent current to the starter so i know that the starter is not bad and the battery has enough juice to do what it's supposed to do so what's next well conundrum well another part of the starting system is this button and it's usually right here it goes with the kill switch all the wires runs through the tube and goes down the neck the stem all the way through the bike and back here to all of your circuits I took the button apart and it was corroded it had black stuff from where the arcs had been made so many times so what I ended up doing was taking my handy dandy pocket knife and scratching the terminal. The bottom terminal here, this is a grommet and this is the top terminal. This is probably the positive and that's probably the negative. Either way, it's a one-way switch. It only activates when you push the button. Also on the bottom of the button, you will see this spring which sits like this and when you push the button the two connect and it bridges the circuit well this was dirty too it was black note to self this little piece right here will fall out don't lose it don't lose this don't lose your screws they're tiny and you can see how hard it would be to find so in a nutshell taking scratch off all of the black stuff and I'm about to put it all back together. I'm pretty sure that's gonna work. Just for the nature of connections when there's corrosion, it, I don't know, it, it kind of makes a barrier between the metals and it doesn't allow for conductivity. So that's my short clip. If you have issues starting and it's not the battery, it's not the starter solenoid and it's not the starter, it's the kill switch. Or the button start button is the one I'm working on um, good luck with your endeavors I hope this helps you happy day